Uncle Jerry Swivers Bay at the Statue of Liberty, Budlow's Island, New York City. An original Yankee story by Mr. Carol Stewart. <laughs> well, I've seen a good many pictures, and he'd tell a whole lot of various times about that Statue of Liberty. You folks who got down here in New York, and how loud it must be. Pretty interesting sort of a sight, and calculated I'd have to go and see it. So the other day, I got on one of these little boats, what goes over to Bedlow's Island, and I went over there to see that Statue of Liberty. Well, sir, there is a dog on this biggest overgrown, lopsided woman I calculate I ever seen in my life. <laughs> but I couldn't tell just what to make out of it. At first, I walked all round, round, round it. It looked to me like a wash woman out of work standing up there with a bar of soap in one hand and wash board in the other. Well, I concluded I'd like to climb up around her nose or chin or ear up there someplace. I allowed I could see a long ways if I got up there. Well, I give a fella two bits to let me climb up on the inside and he showed me a little pair of steps, reminded me of stairway into old Ezra Hoskins' haymouth, just about as narrow and twice as dark. <laughs> well, I commenced to climb, and I climbed and climbed and climbed till the louder must be up around chin or ear and nose or up there somewhere, and I stepped out a little door, what I seen, and dry shawl fiddlesticks. I hadn't got up any farther than a big toe. <laughs> well, I don't know what they put them horns around her head for, because no American girl needs any horns to protect her. If she don't want you to hug her, well, you can't a darn bit hug her no more, and you can shoo a hen, and that settles it. <laughs> well, I want to say to that Mr. Bartholdy right now, if he wants any more models for Statues of Liberty, he wants to get some of our Yankee girls because we got some of the best looking specimens of womanhood trapping around these United States that nature ever turned out when she was uh, doing her best work. Well, I like the idea of what that statue represents, Liberty, and it looks pretty nice at night when they got the candle lit up. So all I've got to say is hooray for the statue, hoorah for Liberty, hooray for Bartholdy, Uncle Sam, the whole dog on business, United States, so in hooray. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.